the moment you guys all been waiting for, board briefing for January 8th on Friday. Our warm up, we got three rounds, 30 second hollow hold, 10 glute bridges, 20 prisoner good mornings. Um, then we got some prep work here and it involves a bit of a frog stretch. Okay, so we're gonna hang out and frog stretch for two minutes. Then we're gonna hit this two rounder of 10 kettlebell sit-ups per side, 10 kettlebell pass-throughs, 10 kettlebell bridge-ups per side. And then we're gonna review the movements in the workout. Okay. And then three, two, one, go. We have 40, 30, 20, 10 of sit-ups, Russian dumbbell swings or kettlebell swings, and then stationary lateral step-ups. Okay, let's break the warm-up down a little bit. Um, getting the core fired up. These glute bridges, you wanna put some weight on it, go ahead and do so. So you can put a uh, weight across your, your hips and do some glute bridges. Prisoner good mornings, if you wanna use a dumbbell to do some good mornings as well and challenge yourself, go ahead. Um, otherwise, we'll do prisoner ones, okay? Our frog stretch, we're just gonna get our um, inseam or our groin muscles, adductors, uh, stretch out a little bit. Links are posted for these three movements. Basically, we're gonna split the Turkish get up. Uh, up. So we're working on some stability through the shoulder and uh, stability through the core. Um, yeah, so challenging, but gonna be fun, okay? Then our workout, right? We have 30, sorry, 40, 30, 20, 10. We got sit-ups, Russian dumbbell swings, and then stationary lunges. So when it comes to the lunge, right? the stationary lateral step-ups, we are gonna split them in 20s, the first round. So it's 20 on one side, you must complete the one side before starting the next side, okay? Foot can stay up on the box, foot comes down, touches the ground, you can go right back up. Let's also keep in mind that we want good posture, okay? So let's have our um, full foot on the box, pressing down through our heels, activating our glutes, instead of leaning too far forward and getting on our toes and starting to use our quads too much, right? With the dumbbell for these, these step-ups, you can hold the dumbbell however you'd like. Sorry, you can hold the dumbbell any position you like. However, your hand must be wrapped around it. So no just resting the dumbbell on your shoulder and putting your hand like this on top. Right? So you've got to hold it front rack, down here, goblet, however you want to do it. It's your choice. Just your hand has to be wrapped around it. Okay? Um, yeah, that's it. Challenging day. Um, hit it hard, boys and girls.